Welcome to an Off the Cuff with JP here at Lynn Brizzy. Things just got freer. And if free couldn't be more freer, it's like somebody's already naked. What else can you take off? Well, Brizzy just included some extra new features within Brizzy Cloud Free. So the tutorial that I released, what, two weeks ago, completely lots of changes has happened with that. So the first one is that from now on, in Brizzy Free, you can make multiple pages. What does that mean? So let me just see, this was my final one in the edit project with the, the site we had worked on, the business development site for consulting. I had created this one page. If you go now to the settings in the sidebar on the left, you will see that from the splash screen, you get pa -pa 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 pages. And then you can say, add new page. You see where I'm going with this? And over here, you can edit it. Wait, let me, oh, I just activated that. So here I create the new page. Let's just put something there. I, let's choose a block. This block is a good block. It's as good a block as any day. And then let's just go back to our settings so I can show you what has happened. I can edit this page. This is the new one that we've created and currently editing it. So I can change the name here to an About Us page and then here About, and I can add something there as well. While I'm here, what else do you see? Do you see it? Well, look over here, pop-ups. <laughs> you still need to go pro to get that. But here is the other thing that you should be looking at. And that is now in free. You can create menus because you have now multiple pages. So you need a menu. So if I call this my new menu, I can create this, add a plus to create the new menu. And there we have it. Then make sure you select it here from the top, uh, my new menu. And then over here, go your pages and add them. And thus, my friend, you have created your menu for your pages. And what you do now, save your changes. Did I do that? Let me make sure, save that, exit here. Here I am in my page. Let's bring in a block, add a blank block at the top. So I'm going to go to reorder blocks, drag it to the top, and then look here. There is a new menu element. You may wonder why I have so few elements. If you had watched the tutorial that I had done, you will know that I've taken the guys out that I'm not using. But in this case, I'm leaving in menu, click and drag it. And there you go, click on it. Control, let's update that, say Control F5. Okay, Control F5, make sure it loads. And after it is loaded, it will display it properly. So if you run into that thing, just reload your page or switch to another page. So if you have more than one menu, you will select it over here. These were previously pro features. Now they are free, freer features. Sure, another tongue twister. I just love to come up with these tongue twisters while I'm working. So let me just save this before I exit here. This is right now available. So if you have Brizzy Cloud free and you like working with Brizzy Cloud free, now you can create pages for your sites and you can do that on unlimited sites. You still have the other restrictions like the projects over here. And one new restriction is that for publishing, this becomes a Brizzy Cloud Pro feature where previously it was included in the free version, but the custom domain has wangled and moseyed over to the Brizzy Cloud Pro. But come on, for a free CMS, which is a content management system, a free website making platform, I, I just don't know what you can ask for. There is nothing like Brizzy Cloud free in the world at this moment, creating websites, unlimited, multi-pages to your heart's content. This was a very brief off the cuff. Just wanted to share with you this update and I'll jump into some more tutorials to bring in these updates into them. This is JP. Have a good night. Have a good day. Signing off.